Two hours east of Seattle, nestled in the beautiful Cascade Mountains, lies the town of Leavenworth, Bavarian style town, very cute. Uh, today we're bringing a little piece of that here to Studio 13 Live and a look at a new boutique hotel and one of their unique farm to table restaurants. Yeah, for that we are joined by Lucas Samania with Mana Restaurant and Rob Ahrens with Hotel Leavenworth. Welcome. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks for, for being us. here. Thanks for making the trek over <laughs> here. I'm glad you, you stayed overnight last night. You didn't have to drive super early, early this morning, early. right? <laughs> yes. That's the pro yes. move right there. Uh, Lucas, kind of tell us what inspired your restaurant in Leavenworth and how did your lifestyle impact that decision to open it? Yeah, so um, my wife and I uh, were living in Germany at the time, actually. Oh, cool. And then we decided to come back to uh, Wenatchee, um, where my family has uh, kind of like a small vineyard there, mm -hmm. uh, to help them out. Uh, recently after, I, I learned about Mana Restaurant, um, heard that it was a very, very cool place to work, yeah. and decided to go there. Great. Oh, that is amazing. Okay, so tell us a little bit about Mana the restaurant and, and the type of food people can find there. Yes, it's a very international cuisine. Um, my family comes from Germany, Argentina, uh, Brazil, all over the world. Yeah. So that kind of inspires, inspires us, especially the, the forage ingredients mm -hmm. that uh, the area has to offer, like these uh, chanterelles and also the small farms as well. Okay, cool. So what are we making today and what ingredients are we using? Yeah, so we have a delicious, it's a tomato bisque here um, with some crab shell in it actually. And uh, we're poaching a halibut inside there. The halibut's been poaching for just about two minutes, so it's uh, probably at its um, final touches there mm -hmm. uh, with a little bit of a daikon, um, some, some mushrooms. We have a vegan dish as well today. Um, yeah, it has some nice uh, uh, mushrooms in, in there as well. It's, it's the rainbow chanterelle. So. Ooh, and chanterelle, that's a mushroom. Who picked that mushroom? Um, my friend Nathan did actually, so he's Shout a Shout out Nathan. Talk about the yes. table. <laughs> yes, yeah. Very cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, so while you keep working on the finishing touches here, uh, Rob, I'm going to ask you about, you know, you recently opened Hotel Leavenworth in the heart of downtown. Uh, so walk us through what that property is like inside. I've seen pictures. It's so beautiful. Yeah, we really went with an alpine feel, kind of to go with the mountains and the, the scene that we're in in Leavenworth. Uh, we have 16 rooms. We're the newest boutique hotel in Leavenworth. We just reopened in May. Um, completely redid everything, spent almost 200 hours per room to get it ready. Wow, that is a lot of time and love. <laughs> oh. And you know, Christmas time's always so beautiful yes. there, and I'm sure it's very busy too. How early should people be looking to book their stay mm -hmm. there, and who would you say it's best for too? Uh, it's best for everybody. We get tons of families, we get couples, people come from all over the world. That was one of the big surprises last year. We had probably 25% of the people were local and people came from Asia, came from Europe, came from all over America. Um, they actually start booking a year at least in advance. Whoa, we still have plenty so of rooms wild. available, okay. but the earlier the better, always. Yeah. Wow. I'm living so my life one week at a time. I, know. <laughs> I, know. I have to say, this is just so perfect because coincidentally, I lived in Germany with my husband for a short time, mm -hmm. and we've been trying to get that feeling back, and I'm getting it here at the hotel. So tell us a little bit about some of the hidden gems and things that people can do in Leavenworth. Yeah, Leavenworth really revolves around the area that it's in. So we've got the mountains, we've got the river, we've got the downtown area so if you're going to the mountains it's great for camping hiking and in the winter skiing um, the river in the summer is great for tubing you can also go stand up paddle boarding or Ooh. rafting and then the city's great you know you can go shopping all day long drinks in the afternoon and evening okay. and then there's great restaurants like mana as well mm -hmm. beautiful so how's the best coming good I think we're about finished here I'm just going to take out the fish here and then we can get ready plate and pour as well. Wonderful. I'm always so impressed by soups because yeah. I feel like they require so many steps. So I love to go to a restaurant for a nice meal. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. So Look at this. Yeah, here's just a little bit of a uh, roasted daikon um, with some purple Napa cabbage uh, from a farm called uh, the Maverick Farm. That's Remind people there. what daikon is. Yeah, it's, um, it's a, a larger root vegetable, um, and it's a little bit spicy. Um, it has a very crisp uh, flavor to it, and, and yeah, naturally delicious. Mm -hmm. so. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. And then, yes, yeah, so we have this awesome tomato um, crab bisque, and the, the halibut and the crab are from our friends um, at Wild Pacific Foods. Uh, his name's Lawton, uh, very delicious uh, seafoods that he supplies. 
Wonderful. Don't you love that he has like the names of the people? I yeah. think it makes it so special. Yeah. You've got good friends gonna... that help you out, huh? Yes. <laughs> so we're just going to plate that in there here. And then take some of this awesome, it's a mixture of uh, wakame, a little bit of a, um, um, some, some micro herbs as well, mm -hmm. cilantro mm -hmm. plus some basil. And little flowers? Flowers, yeah, that's the cilantro oh, flower wow. there. Oh, I didn't so know it had a flower. That Me there. either. Yeah, so. Wonderful. And that's from the Campo Farm as well. So. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. are, we, are we good to give it yeah, a little shot? Yeah, this try? is ready to go, actually. Yeah, right, here so we go. Okay. That's it there. And I love that uh, you have something for us meat mm. here, so something for vegan friends as Ooh, well. Ooh, this is so good. <laughs> I highly recommend ordering yeah. this. So many different textures and mm -hmm. yummy flavors in this. Mm -hmm. Wow, mm. this is amazing. Also, when there's flowers on your food, I mean, how can you go wrong there? You cannot. Oh my gosh. Mm. You also brought us uh, dessert to try. Yes, yeah. but before dessert, we have okay. a little bit of a of a palate cleanser. Okay. Um, it's oh. a it's a freshly uh, made cucumber uh, verjou as well. This is Ooh. this is yeah. It's a nice refreshment. Oh my gosh, that's really good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Yes. Beautiful. And mm -hmm. you said a verjou is what? A, a verjou. Actually, we have some green grapes to try here as well. Um, mm. It's from our family's vineyard. Mm -hmm. um, it's. Uh, essentially just a freshly squeezed green grape juice so oh. it's, it's very tart actually so mm -hmm. right now is the perfect time to harvest these green grapes before they're ripe actually awesome so. all right we got to jump into yes. this dessert yes. okay the dessert you two are actually going to scoop um, the sorbet onto these two desserts oh, there. Okay. So it's ready Where to go. Where should we put it? Just right on top of the, uh, the top? huckleberries as well. Okay. Yeah, so that's probably not as pretty of a scoop know, as you would I do. Oh, that's not beautiful. a professional that's... plater. Oh, I like knock down it's, the it's flour earthy. and everything. <laughs> <laughs> Don't hire me for your recipe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, we're right. going to try it awesome. now. Yeah. We good? Okay. Right. Oh, Describe a, it to us as we're... Oh. There's a finally, final touch here. There's okay. a little bit of a chocolate sauce that you have to get on top. That's a Yes. A drizzle, a drizzle. Okay. Okay, here you go. Thank you. <laughs> so All right, fun. I'm gonna just like yeah. snag up right it here. This is mm. the I almost don't want to ruin this beautiful dessert right here. Okay. Mm. Wow. Mm. What a way to start a Friday. Thank you so much. Mm. Mm. This is great. This is fantastic. Wow. <coughs> gonna Delicious. Come, come see us. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Thank you both for coming to join us today. This has been fabulous. And remember, Leavenworth, always a good time. Yeah. We'll see you Monday. Have the best weekend ever. Mm -hmm. Enjoy the sunshine. I want to see you smile. Take you another mile. Don't